<clears throat> What's going on, guys? I have original clips here with a video today, and today's topic is being a Canadian Bella Song Flipper. And how you should be safe about it because it is a very big concerning hobby as much as we love it, you know, we can't be flipping in public unfortunately like other places that kind of don't mind the hobby. So, firstly, do not flip in public because that is not safe at all. Trainer or not, people will get worried about it. As much as you love to show off some awesome skills, you know, as you're developing them, just like me. But my approach is to get it all out there on YouTube. Like, <clears throat> I love the hobby. It is a great hobby. But trainer blade or not, definitely not because you should already know that they're illegal. <laughs> Trainers are not illegal. They are very legal. We are allowed to own trainers, but we cannot flip them in public still. So, and if you do want to flip outside, I, and it, I suggest doing it in an isolated area where no one can see you because last thing you want is getting it possibly taken away and going through a hassle to get it back. Let's just prevent that, you know, <laughs> flip safely. Canadian flip safely. So now that that's out of the way, where are you Canadians at? And I'm not saying where you're at, like I'm wondering where you are, but give a shout out, you know? I wanna hear from you guys. Like, I know there's got to be more Canadian flippers out there. More Canadian flippers with some awesome talent. Other places got their communities building. Why don't we get ours built, huh? Not that it's like a rivalry against other countries, but I am doing these videos mostly because I enjoy the hobby, but also because I want to help you guys out. I know there's got to be people concerned in Canada whether they should get something or not. And I wouldn't mind helping you guys out. I'll be doing reviews on the collection I currently have. <clears throat> like I said, I've been flipping for almost seven months now, six months. I, oh, I think I'm a little bit. Uh, yeah, it's been five months, yeah, since this early December. But yeah. I want to help you guys out, especially 
if you're going to be investing in something, you know. With today's economy and shit. <laughs> you definitely want to get what you're paying for. And I will be doing a review on this Novelist V2. Not just that one. It's here, Kraken from a Value Plus. So this is a, a clone of the Kraken V25 or whatever. Yeah, I'll be doing a review on this guy as well. And then I have... <clears throat> nah, I can't find it. But anyways, there is the one trap that I also have. That is on AliExpress. I just generally like... The design of it. That's my reason of getting the trap. <laughs> so I don't flip it at all, really. Like it just looks nice. And I'm going to be giving that away. But I wanted to get a review done on it first. Before I give it away. So I have friends who also want to get into the hobby. Nah, get into this hobby. Oh yeah, you'll be seeing more videos from me for sure. Give my own tips. So, be great to get some Canadian sport. Ask ah, sport, <laughs> support. Hit that subscribe. Yeah. I am here for my hobby and you guys. And I think that's all I really got to say now. So I will leave this with a kiss goodbye. With his D Joker fan. Yeah. Aboriginal flips. Peace.